Ford SID2 12 EVO Add Blue Off Unlock Auto Tuner Full Guide and Review. Hey everyone, this is Hussein, and welcome back to Bobji Motors, your ultimate destination for everything automotive, from diagnostics and programming tools to the latest ECU solutions. Before we dive in, a quick but important disclaimer. This video is purely for educational and informational purposes. Everything I'm showing is meant to guide technicians, enthusiasts, and learners, and all trademarks or references belong to their respective owners. Always follow manufacturer guidelines and local laws when working on vehicles. Now, here's a question for you to think about while we explore today's topic. Why did it take six long years for the Ford SID212 EVO ECU patch to finally get unlocked? Stick around until the end, because I'll share some behind-the-scenes insights and a unique industry fact you won't hear anywhere else. Today, we're talking about the Ford Continental SID212 EVO ECU and the solution for disabling AdBlue, something that has puzzled many technicians for years. For context, the Ford Transit and Transit Custom models from 2019 onward came with this locked ECU. Behind the scenes, software engineers have been working on cracking this system for over six years, and the reason it took so long is pretty interesting. The manufacturer patch on these ECUs was extremely tricky, crafted to resist any conventional tuning methods, and that's what made this such a challenge for the aftermarket tuning world. Now, thanks to some of the top tools in the industry, this is finally possible. Two well-known ECU programming tools now fully support this process, but our go-to solution has been AutoTuner. Using AutoTuner, we can perform a VR, which is essentially reading the ECU data and create a fully modified file ready for tuning. Here's how the process works. First, the ECU is split into two stages. This two-stage split allows AutoTuner's headquarters in Luxembourg to carry out the manufacturer unlock process safely and efficiently. Once the ECU has been unlocked at HQ, it's sent back to the technician ready for custom tuning. It's a careful and precise operation that ensures the ECU isn't damaged and that the AdBlue system can be safely disabled. When looking at the ECU data, technicians notice some fascinating details. The SID2-12 EVO has similarities with the older SID2-11 ECUs, which were easier to modify and could be done directly via OBD for pre-2019 models. That meant technicians could see familiar structures and functions within the newer ECU, but the complexity and security patches made the VR reading and unlocking process more sophisticated. Timing is also important for anyone planning this procedure. The VR read time for the SID212 EVO takes about 1 minute and 10 seconds. After reading, the tool corrects the checksums and flashes the modified file which takes roughly 1 minute and 58 seconds. Once the process is complete, the ECU is fully ready for use. In terms of turnaround, technicians can expect the entire job, from sending the ECU to AutoTuner HQ, having it unlocked, and receiving it back, to take anywhere from 4 days to 1 week, depending on when the ECU is collected. This relatively quick turnaround is a major improvement compared to the years the community waited for a solution to emerge. For technicians and vehicle owners, this is a game changer. It means older workarounds and risky software tweaks are no longer necessary, and you have a professional, manufacturer-supported way to handle the SID212 EVO ECU. It's not just about disabling AdBlue. It's about safe, reliable, and fully supported tuning that preserves the ECU while giving full flexibility to the technician. So, here's the answer to the question I posed earlier. Why did it take six years to crack the Ford SID212 EVO? The answer lies in the ECU's sophisticated security patch and the manufacturer's intent to protect it. Only recently, with tools like AutoTuner and extensive R&D, could technicians finally perform a VR, unlock the ECU, and safely modify it. From my perspective, this is one of the most impressive breakthroughs in recent ECU tuning history. It shows how persistent research, collaboration with tool developers, and attention to technical details can overcome even the toughest manufacturer protections. I'd love to hear from you. Have you ever worked with the SID212 EVO 
Or are you curious about the ad blew off process on Ford Transits? Drop your thoughts, experiences, or questions in the comments below. Here's a fun fact. The SID212 EVO ECU shares internal similarities with the SID211, but the security upgrade was so advanced that it took years for the aftermarket community to fully understand it. That's a testament to how quickly automotive electronics have evolved in the last decade. Finally, if you enjoyed this video, help us hit our target, 10,000 likes and 1,000 comments. Don't forget to hype this video and subscribe to Bob G Motors for more professional insights and unique ECU solutions. Thanks again for watching till the end. And as always, keep learning, keep exploring, and happy diagnosing.